Samiri or the Samiri Arabic, Al -Samri translate. As Samiri is a phrase used by the Quran to refer to a rebellious follower of Moses who created the golden calf and attempted to lead the Hebrews into idolatry. According to the 20th chapter of the Quran, Samiri created the calf while Moses was away for 40 days on Mount Sinai, receiving the Ten Commandments. In contrast to account given in the Hebrew Bible, the Quran does not blame Aaron for the calf's creation and instead praises him for trying to stop the worship of it. In the Quran In Taha, the Quran's 20th surah, Moses is informed that Samiri has led his people astray in Moses's absence. He returns to his people to berate them, and is informed of what Samiri has done. They said, We did not fail our tryst with you of our own accord, but we were laden with the weight of the people's ornaments, and we cast them into the fire, and so did the Samiri throw, then he produced for them a calf, a lifeless body with a low. And they said, This is your God and the God of Musa, Moses, so he forgot. Did they not see that it did not answer them, nor could it bring them any benefit or harm? Harun Aaron had certainly told them earlier, O oh my people! You are only being tested by it. Indeed your Lord is the All-Beneficent. So follow me and obey my command, Moses said, And what is your case, O Samiri? He said, I saw what they did not see, so I took a handful of dust from the track of the messenger and threw it, thus did my soul entice me, Moses said, Then go. And indeed, it is decreed for you in this life to say, no contact, and indeed, you have an appointment in the hereafter you will not fail to keep. And look at your God to which you remain devoted. We will surely burn it and blow it i.e., its ashes into the sea with a blast. Quran 20-95 In Islamic tradition The Quran's statement that Samiri's calf made a lowing sound has resulted in much speculation. A number of Islamic traditions say that the calf was made with dust trodden upon by the horse of the angel Gabriel, which had mystical properties. Some traditions say that the calf could also move, a property granted to it by the dust of the horse of life. Other traditions suggest that Samiri made the sound himself, or that it was only the wind. Still others say that the calf was formed by Allah himself, as a test for the Hebrew people. Later traditions expand upon the fate of those who worshipped the calf. Works by Al-Tabari include a story in which Moses orders his people to drink from the water into which the calf had been flung. Those guilty of worshipping it were revealed when they turned a golden hue. Moses ordered his people to kill them, resulting in thousands of casualties, but the carnage stopped after Moses begged Allah to stop the violence. Samiri's punishment has been interpreted as total social isolation by most scholars. <inaudible> Identity Scholars of Islam have linked Samiri to various individuals mentioned in the Bible. Due to the fact that as Samiri can mean the Samaritan, some believe that his character is a reference to the worship of the golden calves built by Jeroboam of Samaria, conflating the two idol-worshipping incidents into one. However, recent research revealed that the Samaritans are the direct descendants of the Joseph tribes, Ephraim and Manasseh and that until the 17th century CE, they possessed a high priesthood descending directly from Aaron through Eliezer and Phinehas. Samiri has also been linked to the rebel Hebrew leader Zimri on the basis of their similar names and a shared theme of rebellion against Moses's authority. Others link him to the Mesopotamian city of Samara and suggest that he came from a cow-worshipping people, giving his name as Musa bin Zafar. There is no consensus among Islamic scholars on which, if any, of these identifications is correct. In the Baha'i Faith The Baha'i Faith portrays Samiri as a magician who led people away from the knowledge and justice of Moses to ignorance. He is mentioned in the Kitab i Icon, the primary theological work of the Baha'i religion. See also Moses in Islam Aaron Golden Calf References, <references>